Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix this virtual control error with FC26 game on your Windows computer. Now for this, if you have DS4 running, you can just make a right click and then close this. If you have REWSD running, close it. You can go over here, click over here. If you see DS4 windows, make a right click and then exit. If you find w R E W S D running, make a right click and then close it. Also, if you have these, like if you have daemon tools running, you can close it. So you can make a right click on the start menu and then go to task manager. Now, if you find daemon tools over here, uh, you can make a right click and then end the process over here. Make a right click, then click on end task and then make a right click on the start menu. Go to device manager and then expand unit storage controller if you find daemon tools over here make a right click then click on disable device click on yes and expand this universal serial bus controller if you have daemon tools over here make a right click disable it and then launch the game if you have auto hotkey running on your computer uh, you can close this application if you have joy 2 key running it's sometimes it's hidden over here so you have to exit and then if you have razor synapse corsair icue application running close it if you have any other anti-cheat program like face it if you have riot vanguard or over here if you see this riot client running close it vanguard also if you see vanguard close it if you have this uh, logitech g hub or either mouse application uh, you can close this application so you have to close it, uh, you have to end the process in the task manager as well as you have to open device manager. If you find the entry for those applications, you can make a right click and disable those applications. If you find XVDD SCSI mini port uh, in device manager, so you might see this. I don't have it, but if you see this in device manager, you can make a right click and disable it. If you see Corsair bus in device manager, make a right click, disable it. If that does not work, you can even uninstall these application. Now let me inform you, troubleshooting is not limited to these application. If you have any third party application or services running, close the app and then end its services in task manager and disable it in device manager if it is present. Also, if you have any third party application like VLC, codec, wallpaper engine, MSI apps, make sure that you close it from the task manager and then you have to relaunch the game and then check. So that should help you to fix this error. So that'll be all. Thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel.